Thanks, Sandeep. At the outset, I would like to um, uh, convey my best wishes to you and to all the readers of the uh, GDN. Um, I wish them all the best in the days and weeks to come. Um, on the question of trade, uh, uh, the Indian ambassador's emphasis on trade is a reflection of the strengths of the bilateral partnership between India and uh, Bahrain. Uh, as you know, over centuries the engagement between India and Bahrain has mainly through the, been in the commercial sphere right. and trade is the most clear manifestation of, the, uh, of this uh, commercial engagement. If you look at the trade the last year, uh, it reached a very high level of 1.6 billion US dollars. Now I would say it is a little bit of an abno uh, abnormal uh, uh, figure. Largely because of because it it, ref, uh, it reflects the response to pent up demand during the COVID lockdown period. So immediately after the restrictions of the COVID lockdown were li lifted, the uh, uh, trading uh, at very high uh, levels took place, and that's why you have 1.6 billion dollars. I expect this year to sort to see a sort of correction, and some of the data that we see reflects that around 750 to 800 million US dollars of bilateral trade has taken place in the past uh, 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 few months uh, since the beginning of this uh, uh, financial year. So um, uh, the pent up demand for uh, travel uh, is getting released uh, in the last uh, year and a half and it is very visible in the case of uh, Indian tourists visiting Bahrain in the first six months of this year, as I noted in my speech at the BIS, uh, more than 500,000 Indians visited, uh, traveled to Bahrain, compared to 269,000 plus Indians traveling to Bahrain in the first six months of 2022. So, in the first six months of 2023, it was 500,000, which is almost double the for for the corresponding period. Here again, I would say this is a sort of a, a, a more than normal uh, movement, uh, amount of movement because it, uh, it caters to the pent up demand. I expect a, some sort of correction to come, but nevertheless, India will remain one of the major source markets for uh, tourist inflows into Bahrain. And that we are seeing in uh, wherever we go across, uh, go around in Bahrain. Um, when uh, uh, in, in the two months period that I have been here, w the sheer number of uh, official delegations that are visiting not only from the central government but also state governments and also with specific focus on tourism is quite admirable. Uh, we also see a lot of uh, people travelling here with the uh, change in the uh, uh, weather, change in the seasons and uh, uh, trying to uh, make use of uh, the tourism facilities in Bahrain. Uh, last week there was a delegation from the state of Karnataka. This, uh, today, even, this week there is a delegation from uh, uh, Goa. I think these are all, uh, these all will give uh, impetus to the uh, tourism uh, movements between India and, uh, India and Bahrain. 